School of Cup 7 Boys, where it has produced two presidents, Daniel Moy and William Ruto. There is what we call in literature the use of human missing, Madam Speaker. <laughs> <laughs> Senator Cheraldige, for Senator Cheraldige, for the benefit of the members who cannot understand that heavy language, can you repeat yourself? Mar Madam Speaker, let me say in literature is what we call symbolic language. I just say it reading newspapers like. Uh, I use it figurative. I didn't mean but Senator Ledama reads the newspaper upside down. Can I proceed to prosecute my Proceed. Three issues? The explanation is acceptable. Proceed. Yes. <laughs> Madam Speaker, and therefore, <laughs> Madam Speaker, it is under literature. Article 153 use of literature. and Article 154, <laughs> Madam Speaker, <laughs> you know the minority side have a habit of working out so there is no problem. And I, I sympathize and empathize with minority side. If the leadership of the whips are people who are heckling, it is very unfortunate. But I'm speaking at the standing order number 34. But I'm speaking, it talks about 9.30 to 1 p.m. But I'm speaking, it is very unfortunate that the number of my colleagues who are chairs Madam Speaker, when you pose a question, they have to go literally looking for a cabinet secretary. This is an opportunity to put the, the cabinet secretary on the dock yeah. and ask him about Nairobi Expressway. Let's have CS for transport to come here. Ask him about drought. The CS of East Africa, the, uh, East Africa community, Madam, uh, Madam Speaker, let us have cabinet secretaries appearing before us so that we can help them by not by the balls, Madam Speaker, but... <laughs> Madam Speaker, so that we can help the cabinet secretaries by accountability. This house, Madam Speaker, is a house of representation, is a house of oversight, Madam Speaker, and therefore, I don't know why senator, other senators, especially